Hey guys, it's Hadrian here. How's everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. If you guys are new to the channel, let me know down below. Say hi. I'd love to hear from you guys. Um, so I'm going to start off this video by just giving a little preface because the haul for this video came out yesterday when you're going to be seeing this video. So I accidentally put two haul videos up yesterday instead of today. Long story, I accidentally um, <laughs> uploaded or I accidentally um, put up or made the wrong video first and I was like oh I made the wrong video I'm just gonna make the other one and then put it up but I accidentally put up both I don't know how that happened but this is the video for yesterday's haul so I'm gonna leave a link right here if you guys want to check out that video after this one and also stay or watch this whole video because at the very end I'm gonna have a little announcement for just a little giveaway that I'm gonna be doing I had so much fun with the last giveaway and you guys have been asking me so much about it that I decided to do another one just like just a little thank you just it's nothing too dramatic but um, I think it's fun so stay tuned and on to the thirteen video Greetings and salutations YouTube. How is everyone doing today? I hope you guys are all doing fantastic. If you guys are new to the channel, welcome. Let me know in the bottom if you're new. I'd love to say hi to you. Um, I am here at the Goodwill for another episode of Goodwill Hunting. And let's go inside and see if we can find any treasures today. You guys, look at this table. This one was here last time, I believe. Thank you. Oh. Look at these bookshelves. $14.99. Look at this desk. It looks like it has like ears or something. 50 bucks. This little table is actually pretty cute. How much is this going for? This is brand new. Oh, it's 30 bucks. I know this is from Target. And this looks like a water fountain. $119.99. Oh, no, it's not a water fountain. What is it? Oh, fire pit. Interesting. Oh, look at this little yellow side table. 30 bucks. It's so cute. What's this thing? Wall magic. Check out the shoes. Dockers, <coughs> Michael Shaw, CHS. Aldo, Check out like these little bally heels. Hey, this is the second bally thing that I found today. What do you guys think? $5.99? Cop or drop? Is that what people say when they do these videos sometimes? I feel like that's weird when I say it. I don't think I'm that cool. I don't know, these are kind of interesting. They're kind of dirty probably clean it and I'm pretty sure that they're authentic what size are they seven and a half is anyone a seven and a half does anyone want these they kind of look old so I'm not gonna get them I don't think anyone would want to wear them anymore like the they're not like too exciting anymore they've run their course though I don't say that very often I don't know, I still, I'm still thinking about them. Gosh, they're kind of cute though, no? I just don't know if like this perforated thing is like kind of cool, kind of not. What if I dyed it black? These would be actually pretty cool in black, but then this would still be brown and I guess I could just paint it back black with acrylic paint. That would be like a mission. But then it would be look, it would look like a pumpkin with this orange, so maybe not. Never mind, just kidding. Not gonna get it, ignore me. Look at this Mighty Ducks thing. I know the ones that are like embroidered are the ones that are like more fancy. Those are the ones people like. Oh, look at this NASA shirt.
Alright, I'm gonna go to the handbags first. You guys, Halloween is in the air. The Goodwill has tons of costumes and masks. Check that out. Pirate stuff. They have so much stuff. Can I get restroom assistance, please? Restroom assistance. Oh, they moved. The handbags they used to be right here. We move them over there. I gotta go run over there after I look at this cart. Oh, excuse me, sorry. Oh, look how cute these are. What is this? Like a horse? I'm really into this marble like container thing. I'm gonna use this for like pens and stuff. It's only $2.99 and it's like solid marble. It's really heavy. So I think I'll grab that. Let's see what other goodies they have. This is pretty. What other goodies await us here? Excuse me. Can I get back with me? I feel like I look at these same exact things every single time I'm here. Oh, uh, this is cute. $5.99. Oh, it's like broken right there though. These plates are always here. They're like here. Every single time I always see them. These are pretty fun. Set of eight for $9.99. Sango. Kind of cool. I don't know. Think about that. West Bend. Oh, I love these things. Royal Stafford. I love anything like this. It's so pretty. Oh, what's this? Oh my god, it's so heavy. Oh, it's a pot. Can we get boxes right up to the front, please? These are pretty. Ginger. By Stafford. Oh, they have lots of different ones. Oh, this one's the prettiest one. I like this one a lot. They're $1.99 though, they're kind of expensive. Look at the smiley face Santa hat thing. Oh, this picture is fun. Oh, it's chipped though, which is unfortunate. Oh, they have a Rachel Ray thing. <gasps> Mom loves these. Maybe I should get this. She has the same exact one in yellow. Is it chipped or broken anywhere? Oh, it's broken right there. Do you guys see that? Yeah, that's no good. Never mind. Almost Rachel Ray. Alright, check out these mixing bowls. They're like heavy ceramic mixing bowls. $5.99 from Crate and Barrel. And these look brand new. Looks like they haven't even been used. This is awesome. That's a great find. I'm gonna grab that. Thompson pottery. These are, I like this plate. It's really pretty. I actually really like this. I don't know if you guys will like the print. I kind of like these like throwback vintage prints. And this is by Philip Tischler's porcelain made in France. This is from the Metropolitan Museum of Art. Really, really cute. Do you guys like vintage Pyrex? So this is pretty nice. Pyrex Corning, New York, USA, $3.99. And it's in really good condition still. I don't know, maybe I should get this. Okay, so check it out guys. I found that 8-cup Pyrex thing that I found here. It goes 
for, I only found one, it goes for like $45 on Etsy. And they have it here for the low, low price of $3.99. So I think I'm just gonna grab it. It's a great piece, even if I don't sell it, can definitely use it around the house. And Pyrex is awesome and it's really, really durable. And let's see what other goodies I can find here. I've been finding so much good stuff today. Like today is like a really good thrifting day. I'm really, really, really excited. Whoa, cool. Look at these colored plates right here. What do you guys think these are from? Oh, yeah, nowhere. Look at these little crate and barrel plates. How cute. $1.99 though. There's only three of them. Uh, I don't know. Pottery barn. Ooh, cute. Are there any chips on it? I don't know. I think it's just dirty. That's the, yeah, that stuff's coming off. What is this? It's just dirt. How cute. Is this one also pottery barn? Yes. Perfect. I need these. Where's this little thing all the way over here? I don't know what that is. Okay guys, so check out these plates. I found them online and they are literally $33.99 for one plate. And these are $5.99 for all six plates. Look at this cute little teapot and it's $30 and then $55 from two separate sellers on Etsy. It's pretty cute. It's only um, $5.99 I believe. Yeah, it's in pretty good condition so I don't know. I'm inquisitive. Oh wait, there's like a weird little thing on the top. I got this really cute, like, this could be like a bread bowl. It's $4.99 and it's Nordstrom made in Italy. Oh, but it's broken right there. Darn it, purple was the color of the day. It would have been 50% off. Darn you, broken piece. Band of my existence. How cute are these like little teapot, sugar, and milk? This set is $4.99. So if this would focus, check out. This is just like a regular cup. And you look inside and there's a little, a little octopus. He's so cute. And this is only $1.99. They sell online for like over $10, $12. So this is really cute. I think I'm just gonna grab it. Look at I found this really cute container. It's $3.99 so it's purple. So it's the 50% off and it's pottery barn. I'm gonna grab this. This is a really cute container. All right, so so far I have a ton of stuff. Such great plates and bowls and stuff. I'm really excited. Like Pottery Barn Cranger and all that stuff. And then these plates are really cute. And I had a matching um, little teapot and then a bunch of clothes. So I'm gonna do a haul, a separate haul for all this stuff, most definitely. Since um, God, my hair is like such a mess, it's like in disarray. Um, I'm gonna do a separate haul because it's gonna be so huge probably and I'm not even done looking through everything yet so let's find some more stuff. Finally made our way to the handbag section. Unfortunately, it took me a while to get here since I got distracted by all the other stuff that I was looking at. But here's a Dooney and Burke bag. Looks like it's $20. Expensive. Um don't really see anything too exciting. I kind of like that clasp on there though. That looks kind of fun. $6.99 for that bag. Um, well, there's Claiborne. Oh, this feels like eel. <laughs> Have you guys ever felt an eel bag before? It's very interesting. It's really soft. $5.99. This is actually like genuine leather. But the inside is peeling. Must be from like the 80s or 90s. Eighteen Agner U.S. Open Championships. Oh, 
I always see this fringe bag. It just haunts me everywhere I go. Plastic fringe. My favorite. Look at this fake Chanel toe. Oh, the inside is awful. $4.99. Tommy Hilfiger. Nothing else too exciting. All these bags I've seen before. Oh, that feels like a rubber. Ooh, that is a weird texture. Let's see. Ah, uh, Jennifer Lopez bag. That is a bright color. And Klein. I like the feel of this felt, but not of this plastic. Yep, that's it. Nothing too exciting right here. Hey okay guys, I'm gonna give you a quick overview of the clothing that I found thus far. So some St. John, I think this is $7.99. And I'm not gonna show you everything, but I found like free people pants, some page um, sevens, and I found some John Barbados in there too, so. I found two members only jackets. This one looks like it's suede, extra large. Let's see what it's made of. Women's dress women's dress um, oh, it is genuine leather. Ooh, that's cool. I might try that on. And then I found another members only jacket right here in this color combination in like this green. And this one is a size. Oh, it doesn't say a size. That looks pretty large as well, though. What color are these? Are any of them on sale? Oh, those arms, $14.99. I don't know if I can clean that pin out of the suede, but I don't know. Guys, I just left the store. I actually had to bring my car up because I had to put all my stuff inside and it was way too heavy. All right, so, <laughs> ta-da, video's done. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. I had so much fun thrifting. Um, there was so much stuff at that store. Like, it was intense. And again, that video for the haul is up already, so just check it out. I have a link right there. Um, and down below as well in the description box. Hopefully, I, I, I'm so bad at, like, you guys, I'm so sorry if I don't put it up. You guys, I, I always try to remember, it and I'm, like, awful. Just one of those things. But, on to more pressing matters is the giveaway. So, a bunch of you guys have been messaging me and commenting about um, the bags that I made for the giveaway and have asked me if I was going to be selling them or anything like that. I don't think I'm going to be right now at least just because I've been so busy lately um, just thrifting and just uh, making other stuff that I sell and all that other stuff so been a little too busy to start this um, but not too busy to make some more for giveaways so here's the bag I made another one um, so this time I'm just gonna be doing a one bag and the rules are gonna be the same as last time I'll have them down below but there's two ways to enter um, you can enter here on this video you can enter once a day comment down below what your favorite thrifted item was thrifted item was that I have found you have found anyone's found and um, you can also enter on in, on Instagram. So follow me on It's Hadrian or my other Instagram, which is Thrift Concierge, and I'll have official um, posts on there as well. You can comment on the post and then tag two of your friends that love thrifting as well. So super easy, and you can enter that every single day as well. And I'm gonna let this run for two weeks. So this video is going up tomorrow, which is going to be the 26th, and then you have until the 9th of October for your last entry and on the 10th or yeah the 9th of October I'm gonna end it at like noon 
on the 9th of October. And then on the 10th of October, I'll be announcing who the winner is. So, two weeks, enter to win this gorgeous baby. And oh, someone actually told me that I'm at 2,500 subscribers. I didn't even know that, and that is so exciting. So once we get to 3,000, I'm gonna do another giveaway. Like I'll thrift something cool and um, give it away. So super excited, maybe I'll do three items once I get to 3,000 since it's 3,000. So I wish I could make one of these for each and every single one of you guys. These totes are just like so much fun. I've made so many like different totes like this for my mom in the past. And like we just use it for like groceries or like just throw stuff into at the beach or just carrying stuff around, shopping, whatever. So I don't know, maybe I'll make a video showing you guys those bags. Do you guys want to see a video for how to make them? They're really easy. They're kind of self-explanatory. But, I don't know, it's kind of fun still. So, let me know. Um, and again, thank you guys so, so much for watching. And don't forget to enter. You guys have two weeks. <sighs> and as always, if you guys haven't done so, definitely subscribe so you can enter to win. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Love you. Bye.